I will support and defend the Constitution of the United States and the laws of the United States of America against all enemies, foreign and domestic, that I will bear true faith and allegiance to the same. Perhaps that was the most cynical soundbite of my entire 18-year radio career. That's Janet Napolitano of the Department of Homeland Security swearing in, um, I guess, their citizens. I think they were illegal aliens who were instantly made citizens. I can't remember what it was (coughs) on July 4th. But the thing is... Many of us are afraid of the Department of Homeland Security. A new report has come out from DHS, which defines anyone who believes in limited government as a potential terrorist. Now, if you think I'm making this up, that's your loss. Your Department of Homeland Security is not concerned with Muslims who may be wanting to blow up airplanes or Muslims who want to create another World Trade Center disaster. No, but it's anyone in America who believes in limited government is now on the radar of Janet Napolitano's gang at DHS. We have now created a monster within this country. A monster within this country. Shall I read you the rest of the report that's come out of who the DHS now considers an enemy? Who is she to swear people in and uphold the Constitution when she doesn't uphold the Constitution? Does Big Sis uphold the U.S. Constitution, in your opinion? A woman who has fundamentally said the borders don't matter with Mexico... A woman who says to Border Patrol agents, run away when a drug gang points a gun at you. Is she upholding the Constitution of what, of Mexico? Well, that's the story. Unemployment. Want to talk about unemployment?